Hello, my name's Sean Ra, and today I'm looking at another Artoria product. Hot off the heels of the Profit V comes Analog Factory. Analog Factory is a module that utilizes uh, 2,000 sounds from their synth range from the ARP 2600V, the Profit V, the Mini Moog V, the Moog Modular V, and the Yamaha CS80 V. Put into one core cool module. Let's check it out. Uh, basically, uh, really simply laid out, um, you can select the instruments here and then the type of sound that you want uh, and then the characteristics of the sound. So, for example, you could say, right, um, ARP 2600V, uh, I want uh, effects sound, uh, I want it to be complex, and then it will give you a list of those. Uh, they're very simply laid out. Uh, they even have a CPU rating so you know how much CPU power they're going to use. Uh, you can mark them as favourites uh, and then you can go to your favourites list up on the top. Uh, you can save them in user presets. Okay, let's look at your controls. You have a level, you have a resonant filter, LFO, uh, the rate and the amount. Uh, four key parameters, four key parameters, uh, four key parameters that change, uh, that are different for each sound, which is just awesome. Um, uh, chorus, effects mix, uh, delay, ADSR, you've got transpose, uh, you've got a pitch bend and modulation. Uh, and then really cool, you've got uh, little snapshots, you've got eight snapshots. You simply make a snapshot by pressing, by pressing uh, shift and then the snapshot you want to make. So I'm just going to make that in one. And then what I'll do is I'll just open, just change one of the parameters and then take a snapshot of two, uh, change the parameter again, uh, and then make a snapshot, uh, snapshot on three. And then it means that I can just blip through those. So that's three, two, one. It's really simple. Uh, just oodles and oodles and oodles of sounds, really well programmed. Uh, obviously, you know, this, it, this is a palette of 2,000 sounds. You cannot get in there and control them all like you could uh, if you bought the uh, actual synths, but then they're not that much money. Basically, what you've got is awesome sounds. You can just come and, and grab them whenever you want. Uh, let's just uh, show you some of those sounds. So let's say that I want uh, to use the Moog Modular and I want pad sounds and I want them to be quiet, soft, noisy, simple, ambient, complex maybe. So here's a few, some pads, and then I can just split through those. There's a little envelope follower. See they're humongous. Here's a big pad, nice sweep on it. Down here. You can hear the filters really lush, not too thin. You can take the resonance and it doesn't completely disappear. It sounds really nice. Lovely design filter there. Yeah, it's using the LFO. And then we change the key parameters, for example. The sound. There you go. Uh, little sample and hold pad. All sorts, gone forever. Um, I was having this discussion with Nick the other day um, and we were kind of agreeing that um, on the whole bass sound shouldn't be like coloured. Um, a lot of the bass sounds here are, but then that, that actually, you know, you use the filter, you cut it down, there's some huge subs. It gives you the option if you want some funky, squelchy bass line. But, um, I mean, these are really huge sounds. Factory works as a standalone unit, uh, VST, RTAS, and audio units for Logic. Epic, great big suites of pads, um, sequences, loads and loads of sequences, really fat sequences.
Oh, I've got my trance pants on. these things. What's that in the sky? Uh, Analog Factory is uh, dongle based. Uh, the license is kept on here. You, if you have our, other Artoria products you can put the licenses on there and then carry that around and then plug that in. What I'm going to do now is uh, I'm going to uh, close this session and I'm going to load a session that I've done on Pro Tools LE. This is just a one bar loop because um, I'm very, very busy. This is utilizing X-Band for the drums. Uh, the bass line is from Analog Factories, nice fat sub. And again. Ah. Oh. Another finger. Oh, I can't do it. It's dangerous. Ah. Oh. Okay. Sorry, get carried away there. Let's try. Anyway, just zapping through these. Oh. Oh, hold on, hold on. What's that one there? Oh, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, I like this sort of thing. Fade out. Should we do fade out? idea of what I think about Analog Factory. I think it's great. It's such good value for money. Shipping now, street price is approximately £149, €216, Euros, $199. If you are new to synthesis or just can't be bothered to just program loads and loads of sounds, uh, these guys have really done it for you. 2,000 epic sounds, all really, really, really usable. If you're rich, just go out and buy the whole range. You know, you saw how excited I got over it. Uh, it's really good products, really good value for money. Bye-bye.